The philosophy around Fred's is to get the freshest produce from people that we know and trust. The menu changes every day based on what they're able to supply us. So today I'm gonna to go down to Robertson and I'm gonna meet my old friend Phil, pick him up, and we're gonna to go to his organic farm, Moon Acres, about two and a half hours south of Sydney in the Southern Highlands region. This property has some of the most beautiful, incredible soils in the country. It is just magic soil. Its ability to grow food is unmatched. Okay, Danielle, nice day for it. Beautiful. I'm really excited to get to the farm and to see things growing firsthand. We always do a lot of picking things up from the ground and tasting while we're there. And that is really the heart and soul of what inspires our menus at Fred's. I can still remember the first time I met Danielle. I was at a farmer's market and she was setting up a new restaurant and was seeking out people who really cared about the food that they grew. Fussy's not quite fair a word, but she really does care about what she, what she gets. And that kind of inspires me because I know that the food's going to someone who really cares about it. So our method of farming is quite different from conventional farming. The first thing we think about all the time is, are we looking after the soil? What do you think really healthy soil does to contribute to flavour? Your mouth will tell you. As soon as you put that vegetable in your mouth, you can just taste the difference. Just try one of these red kale. So sweet. Yeah, it's sweet. It's got a really strong kale flavour. Mm. And it's like beautifully tender. It almost seems a shame to try and cook it. <laughs> <laughs> I really want to work with people that care about looking after the planet because ultimately that is actually what produces the best tasting food. It's really important to me to understand how producers and farmers manage the soil. I suppose you'd really have to ask the chefs why they buy our stuff. I think they buy it because of the taste and the freshness. One of the restaurants actually sent me a text and said, I can still hear the little heart beating in that spinach, which is really heartwarming to me. And if they're happy like that, well then obviously I'm doing something right. It was really nice to see Phil today. It's always so inspiring when I get to see him doing what he does firsthand. And he's giving me some really beautiful produce. The impact of an incredible organic farmer is actually flavor first and foremost. And every time that I taste something straight from the ground there, I'm reminded of all the energy that those people put into the produce. When you're on the farm with Phil and you're tasting things as they're growing or right off the tree, they taste so alive, which is actually a pretty remarkable thing. And it's something that our guests in the restaurant can connect with because they get to taste it as well.